this is me stopping talking. No more talking. I'm not talking anymore. You sit down and go, and it will be great because the less I talk, the less it gets awkward for everybody else. Oh, look at those lights. And I'm waiting for a cue, and I'm giving away the fact that I kind of fucked it up, but I'm going to keep talking. Hey, you know what? I had this dream at one point. It was me and my grandfather, and we were running down this street, and we were followed by trees on wheels towards some mound that had some sort of metaphoric significance of the darkness of the soul. And I remember thinking to myself, why is my grandfather here? Because he was the one that, although lo very loving, also had some anger issues. Hand second. technical problems you get to do a little song and dance it's great so if you were in my position okay and you were fundamentally tired but you're here because you love it and then you realize that we've got one more or two more three more songs to do yet our technological prowess that had pushed us along and had allowed us to do everything up to this point had fallen to the wayside what would you do you would probably either do one of two things. You would either throw yourself on the ground and hurl yourself in a circle screaming about how unfair it is, or you would start to do what I'm doing right now, which is rapidly and madly trying to improvise about, with very little on my uh, list of things to talk about. Let me think, what's a topic? Anybody got a topic? What's that? I can't hear you. So I'm gonna make up my own topic. Okay, so let's talk about the fact that cephalophallic, what's the word? Not cephalophallic, that probably means like little tiny phalluses. But the, the thing where the animals have the scrunched up faces, what's that called? Cephalophallactic, that one, right? They're incredibly cute, yet they are aberrations of nature. So what do you do? Do you blame yourself for owning them? Do you actually own them? Or is it just a thing where you look out to the audience and you say, oh my God, I'm flailing. Thank God there's three more songs. You know what we could do? We could do another, hey, we're gonna leave the stage thing. And that'll give you guys the opportunity to go buy that shirt that says huge anus on the back. No. I was actually thinking the next time, see, I mean, we're trying to solve problems here, right? So fuck you if you don't like it. No, I don't mean that. I say that because that's what I've been doing for years, but I really don't mean fuck you. I don't mean that at all, actually. I mean, love you if you don't like it. Oh, you know what I could do? I could play an acoustic guitar. Hey, Armando, why don't you bring the acoustic guitar and I'll play an acoustic song. We gotta change the patch. We gotta change the patch. So, hey, Mr. Light Guy, can I get some stage lights? Hey, Mr. His name is Andy. Hey, Andy. Okay, now watch this, guys. Can you um, talk amongst yourselves, preferably in a loud tone of voice, for about uh, 35 seconds, okay? Go. Okay, I don't have to do it because they sorted it out because they're technical wizards. It's because it's how we roll with it, man. After the past two years, that ain't shit, my friend. You guys ready to sing? You're like, we were ready to sing three minutes ago, you dick. Spiritual collide!
be back with a full choir. Until that time, 